Hello everyone, in this video we will see binary trees, identical trees. We are given two binary trees, we have to check whether the two trees are identical, which means the same data in binary tree 1 should replicate the binary tree 2. So this is a sample binary tree and uh, here I have node definition as data and uh, right and left pointer. And here I have the code snippet to start solve that problem. And um, these are all those two trees. Okay, first we'll see what this code is. Here I function name, I've written function name. It expects two parameters, namely node A and node B. This is the root of the these two trees we have to pass into the functions. And in first condition, we have to check whether two nodes are null. Um, the incoming nodes which we are giving is here and here a and b whether they both are null then we have to return it as true in case uh, any one is null and uh, one is not so that means it is not identical because uh, at any one of these trees uh, some data is there so that condition is uh, meant for it's not identical so we have to return false in another case, if the data is mismatching, here it is 10 and if it is here 20, then that's also false. So we have to return false. And the next condition is we have to pass or recursively call this one for the left side and the right side. So when we are traveling at left side and here also left side. So I have to check this, uh, whether the nodes are null. No, it's not. If the, any one of the node is null, no, it is not, and the data is mismatching. No, it is not. So we have to proceed further, and then we have to check here when it is null. Uh, here also null, and uh, here also null. So at, at node forty, when you are checking this, uh, passing this node uh, left, and here also left, both are null. So this condition is true. So here that statements will execute it as true. So this is the case for all of these ground level nodes, the leaf nodes. So combining all together we have to end those and we have to return it as uh, true or false whether it's identical or not. Okay here you can see these two trees are identical. You can see 10, 10, 20, 20, 30, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70 and 40, 50, 60, 70. But here in this tree, um, you can see this uh, this pointer, right side pointer is there, and here it is left side pointer. So we have to print uh, this as uh, when it execute this statement. Um, here it is null, so nothing is there. But uh, here we have some data. So this statements will return false. So the whole or condition will result in no. So so the tree is it's a not an identical tree one more example you can see this uh, same things are there um, left pointer right right and right left pointer and here also the same thing so these are all the example trees for this uh, identical trees so this is very super simple problem uh, but this is a more frequently asked question during the interviews so we'll write the same snippet in uh, Visual Studio Code and we'll see whether this program is executing perfectly or not for the, all of the test cases. Here I have necessary importing statements, include and uh, using. And here I have class node definitions of public properties int, left and right pointer and constructor of those uh, node class. And for main function body, I have written three trees. I'm going to compare this first tree and second tree and the first tree and third tree. So that should result whether that's identical or not. Um, here before executing itself, I'm saying the answer for this because now these two I have just replicated. Um, here it's node n and here m. But the data, whatever is there in the node first, on um, tree first, and uh, it's exactly as tree two. And uh, this you can see uh, some of the nodes are absent in the y tree so i will compare n and y that should result me in uh, false it's a not identical so what we return is we just write int 
I can write boolean also that's totally perfect identical it expects node a and node b if both are null not a and not b uh, this statement is uh, literally equals to uh, equal to equal to null so this condition you can just uh, use this not operator and uh, arp so here you can this is the case you can return it as return true if any one of this a or or b this is the case return false and if the data is mismatching is data not equal to b's data return false and i have to return identical i have to point a is left comma b is left same thing i have to travel so and double and identical a is right and b is right okay now i have to call this here n dot identical n and m i'm passing how to write it in the c out statement okay the same thing for here also n and y okay now i check one more time here i have node a not not and a b and here it should be left and data if it is not then okay my code is perfect and i'll run this program run okay one one means it is identical and zero means it's not okay uh, when I'm first comparing this M and N, it is identical, and uh, this N and Y, it is non identical. So, here is our answer. So, all of our test cases are passing. So, hope you understood this problem and uh, solution. Uh, thank you for watching this video. We will meet in the next video.